Hey Worcester, the state primary election is Tuesday, September 3rd, and it's almost here. The Worcester Election Office would like to provide you with some helpful information. What is a primary election? The September 3rd state primary election determines the candidates from each political party who will advance to the general election on November 5th. Who can vote in a primary election? All voters, including those not affiliated with a recognized political party, unenrolled voters in different political designations, can vote in the primary election. Why is voting in the primary election important? Voting in a primary election is important because it allows voters to determine who the nominees from each political party will be. Candidates who win the primary election in their party will be listed on the general election ballot along with the other party nominees and candidates that are running as unenrolled or independent of a party. Which ballot do I get? Each voter votes with a specific party ballot, depending on if they are registered in a political party. Your ballot type if you are enrolled in a political party is as follows. If you are enrolled in the Democratic Party, you will receive a Democratic Party ballot. If you are enrolled in the Republican Party, you will receive a Republican Party ballot. If you are enrolled in the Libertarian Party, you will receive a Libertarian Party ballot. Unenrolled voters or members of small political designations can vote in the primary, and you do not need to register with the party. Unenrolled voters must choose which ballot type they want to vote. Voters may only vote one ballot, so unenrolled voters will choose a Democrat, Republican, or Libertarian ballot. Choosing a party ballot as an unenrolled voter does not enroll you in a party. The primary ballot will include races for U.S. Senator, U.S. Representative, Governor's Council, State Senator, State Representative, Register of Deeds, and Clerk of Courts. To learn more about the September 3rd primary, including how to apply for vote by mail and registration deadlines, please visit www.worcestermay.gov.